So this week's discussion deals with, and this is unit three, by the way, uh, this week's discussion deals with variables and constants, and it deals with uh, syntactical and logic errors. So the first thing I kind of want to talk to a little bit is variables and constants. A way to think about a variable, and of course your discussions will rule as that, or hopefully move in this direction. But a way to think about a variable, a variable is a way to hold data that will change. A constant is a value that you will not change ex programmatically. So if you have something that is set as, let's say, taxes, uh, wherever you live, I'm just going to throw out a value, it's 5.5%, let's say. That's taxes. Well, you put that as a constant so throughout your entire program you're using the constant of taxes now you might say well why don't I just use a variable value and then put the taxes in there at the beginning of the program I run it I type in my new value that I want and then I go from there well the problem with quotes around it because ideally you could do that as a solution but the problem with doing that as a uh, as a variable is it has a chance of changing modifying or having some sort of error take place to that value throughout your program so you might not know it could be a hidden value that's used in calculations you might not know that change has taken place or that error has taken place and then suddenly you have values being thrown off all over the place and you don't know why and it could be a matter of your taxes variable value being changed by something you didn't anticipate but you don't know it because you just assume it was staying the same, so you're never printing it out, or you were never printing it out. Whereas if it's a constant value, once you declare it as a constant, it doesn't change. And the neat thing about that is, let's say next year, uh, taxes change for whatever reason. I go into that variable value. I make the modifications to that variable value, and lo and behold, now I get a different value as it goes through. That's kind of a constant variable comparison variable you want to change constant you don't and i'm sure this will come out more in your discussion now as far as the errors are concerned it's talking about a syntactical error it's kind of a runtime error and then a logic error and the only thing i'm going to say to that because i'm going to leave that up to you to kind of discuss and get to grips with that is a, a syntactical error is like when almost like when you were a little kid you know i do go playground that is a syntactical error, except you're talking about that programmatically. So I'm going to let you worry about that. And then a logic error is 1 plus 1 equals 3. It's not wrong in the way it runs, but the results are definitely not something that you were anticipating because it doesn't work out exactly right. So both of those options give you a uh, kind of a lead in to the discussion this week. I hope it helps you out. Um, so far, I've been pretty impressed with the stuff people are coming up with and the discussions, and I want to keep that going. Thank you very much for your time. Talk to you soon.